Gadwall are an interesting species because of the recent population changes. For decades, Gadwall plugged along at the same relatively constant number, and then they just took off, and it was like a rocket. They, they basically tripled in population size, and part of that was the occurrence of CRP in the grasslands of, of the Dakotas. Gadwall tend to nest in the prairies, but in the, in the southern part of the prairies. And so uh, when we laid out all that CRP, the fabulous grassland habitat, Gadwall really took off. And one of the interesting things about Gadwall on the breeding grounds is they're a late nesting species. Right now we've got mallards in, in North Dakota that are about to hatch, a few days away from hatching some of the earliest mallards and not a single gadwall is nesting yet. And they probably won't start for about another week. So they arrive on the breeding grounds pretty early, but they sit around for about a month and don't start nesting. So they're one of the latest nesters, even though they tend to arrive fairly early. Um, but they, they uh, are fairly persistent re-nesters, so they'll keep nesting into July. And remarkably successful ducks. Um, really increased a lot recently and that's a great thing for particularly the southern hunters. They're a coastal species, um, go down on the Gulf Coast, most gadwall do, and and, uh, and winter in Louisiana, Texas. So they're a real important species for southern duck hunters.